Well, hi there, pluckers. I'll have a sore finger again with you. Thanks very much for joining me for another guitar lesson. This is the great number by uh, Sting called Fields of Gold. Um, obviously, uh, the number has been covered by many famous artists uh, as well, including the great uh, Eva Cassidy's version, which was uh, oh, a lovely version. Uh, so I've done a sort of a mashup uh, between uh, the Sting version, the Eva Cassidy version, and some bits of my own. Uh, so I'll be doing a, an intro, a couple of verses in the middle section of the song, so you've got all the bits you need to play the song. Um, uh, please excuse my singing as usual, I'll try and keep it to a minimum, and um, way in the background. <laughs> so uh, I can play through it now and then I'll show you what I did. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> You remember me when the west would burn among the fields of barley. You can tell the sun in his jealous sky when he walked in fields of gold. You return my love for to gaze a while among the fields of in his arms she fell as her hair came down among the fields of gold. I never made promises like There have been some that are broken, but I swear in the days till the end. Something like that. <laughs> it's a bit loose for any ages um, because I can't sing it, but never mind. Um, so that's it basically. So uh, uh, I mean, standard tuning, but a uh, capital on the third fret on this particular uh, version I'm doing, okay? Um, so it starts off with a B minor, okay? Uh, you only need to play really the bottom, the top five strings. Don't worry, don't really need, need that one at the moment, the sixth string. So just starts off. Em emphasizing the uh, second fret of the fifth string to strum down to the second from the fifth to the second string really and then take that finger off and just play the open fifth string down from five to two and then let's change to a, a mod G sort of ninth chord uh, third fret on the sixth string and then uh, first finger goes on the uh, second fret of the third string and I'm playing six, four, three, two, okay? Okay, so so far we've got that. Once round on each thing, okay? Okay, then we change to a D with uh, F sharp in the bass which uh, for you who's done the, the Cathy song uh, uh, picking, you'll know this chord. <laughs> it's the uh, first finger on the second fret of the si uh, sixth string, second finger goes on the second fret of the third string, and pinky or third finger goes on to the third fret of the third, uh, second string, sorry, second string. Okay, so that, that sort of shape like that, okay? And again, you play six, four, three, two, okay? Okay, so so far we've got that. So. Okay, then we change to an E minor seventh, just a single finger on the second fret of the fifth string. In fact, you don't need that really. I just I just do it out of habit. You only need the sixth string, the fourth string, uh, third string, and second string. Okay, and then a lazy A. Just bar the, the full bottom, the top four strings uh, on the second fret, and play again 
five, four, three, two. Okay, so that's so far. Okay, and then a D shape. So it's down all the way down from four down to the first string. And when you get to the bottom top string, hammer up to the pinky on suspended fourth. And then hit that note. So with you. Okay. And then put your pinky on the fourth fret. Reach over to the fourth fret of the fifth string. And then you play the B minor. Okay. So the introduction then is this, okay? <coughs> So that's the B minor, <coughs> then the B minor with the open A, fifth string, and then to the G that I've shown you with the ninth. The down to the A to the D. As per the intro. So down to from four down to the first string and hammer up to that note and then reach over with the pinky to the fourth on the fifth string. So it goes and it comes out of the intro. You remember me where when the Now, now the, on the second line of the, um, well, the final line of the verse, it's the progression down that was in the intro. It's okay. So the whole verse is uh, where it goes. So it comes out of the intro. You remember me to the first word. And the second verse, exactly the same as the first verse, right? When it comes out of the second verse, you come out of the fields uh, of. Okay, so it comes out the fields of. You do the you strum a sort of strum D suspended fourth D with a little pinky on the third fret of the top string off open take that finger off and have open top string and then go into a G and I play a G with the on the third fret of the sixth string and pinky on the third fret of the second string and you're playing the six four three two again. That's right, because uh, I never need a promises as before five, four, three, two, like D. Now, listen, then you have to add the F sharp in the bass with your thumb, okay? <laughs> Just then, so, so it's uh, uh, and then add the six on the second on the six and play three, two, one. So, okay, then to G again. A D to G. Then at B minor, and then B minor with the A open. To, to, to G. Just that's just G with just that finger, uh, just playing the six, four, three, two open. Walk in A fields of B minor gold, B minor with the A open, fifth string, yes, will G, 
walk in a field of B minor. B minor with the A open, G sub ninth, uh, F, uh, D with the F sharp in the bass, just like the intro, E minor seventh, A, D. So that's it, that's basically all the bits I play, okay? So uh, play around with that if you like it, uh, change it around, do what you like with it, um, or ignore it, <laughs> whatever. Uh, thanks very much for watching and listening, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. Thank you, bye-bye.